Top story tonight, two days after Sarasota Police Chief recommended the city rezone Newtown to force businesses to close by 11 p.m., people in that district are still talking about it tonight. And even after thinking about it a couple of days, SNN's Melissa Warren joining us now, saying a lot of people still don't like the idea. Well, many people in Newtown have been thinking a lot about the implications of Sarasota Police Chief Bernadette DePino's proposal to city commissioners Monday. And some I spoke with say they know the area has problems and want help from police, but they say the changes proposed aren't going to do that. When the murdering was going on, I was so distraught. I was like praying to God that they did something to stop it because our children were dying. But at the same time, I believe that a lot of the anger from the youth is because they have no outlets. They have no future. They have no one that cares. Latasha White thanks the police for having a presence in her community because that was the first sign someone cared. Once the cameras came up and they told everybody they weren't having it, when a shooting occurs, 30 cops rush into the scene, that's going to slow down the murder. But like White, Leroy Jones says closing stores earlier won't help. Closing the store down at 11, that's going to run everybody out really in the streets. They ain't going to stop you from drinking. They ain't going to stop you from doing nothing. Lifelong resident Alfred Hamilton says it won't just not help prevent disturbances, but hurt everyone else. And he thinks Newtown has been singled out. Anywhere you go, you're going to have problems. But they just want to sing out the black community, and that's wrong. It's not about the stores, it's about the community. Because these stores, they don't do anything for the community anyway. I mean, they don't hire any blacks. Like, say, so you go in there, they won't even let you use the bathrooms and stuff. But when he complains about going in his pocket, then it's a big rap, you know, riff raff about it. But the thing is, the community needs to get together and start standing up for stuff. Because, hey, if they let them do this, that's just the beginning. They're going to start taking everything. Now, White and Hamilton say what the area really needs are programs to help the youth get back on track. All right, so out of this uh, discussion, any ideas on programs? Well, I actually just spoke with Mayor Willie Charles Shaw on the phone this afternoon, and he says the issue won't come up for discussion among the commissioners again until more research is done by their staff on the impact of business hours on crime rates around Sarasota. Right, well, hopefully in the meantime, there will still be meaningful discussions. Yes. Melissa, thanks.